Hello guys, and today I'm going to eat some out-of-date pork pies. This is a pork pie selection for Christmas. Um, it's dated, the expiry date is the 28th of December. It's currently the 30th of December. And today, Donald Trump's tax returns have been released, showing that um, in 2020 he didn't pay any income tax and in 2018 he paid nearly a million dollars worth of income tax i could not have known that on the 28th for sure and also there's a bbc article on it so that proves these are really out of date guys okay now on the back you'll notice the reduce sticker i bought them normally these would have been two pound 40 i got them for 60p because they're about to expire the same day on the 28th these are now officially expired okay and it says it's a pork pie selection. It claims there's two normal pork pies, two pork and stuffing pies, and two pork and cranberry pies, okay? I think I'll open it up. And I'm going to show you each of them, okay? Now, this is a normal pork pie. They haven't put any special topping on, so I'm going to open this up. That is inside of a normal pork pie. I'm not going to eat one bit of it. Now, this is the next pork pie. This looks like it has some stuffing on it. It's got some seasoning on the top. I'm going to... To be fair, I already know what's in these because um, I bought an identical one, also out of date, on the same day, so... To be honest, I never really understood what the difference was. Apart from on the top, because on the top you can see it's got these herbs or whatever they are. And inside, to be honest, it looks the same to me. I couldn't really see much of a difference, truthfully. And so now I'm going to eat some of this. With the seasoning on the top, they claim it's stuffing, and on the back, which I'll show you in a minute, if I manage to do this, there's two pork and stuffing pork pies topped with a sage and parsley crumb topping. Again, I'm still not convinced there's any actual stuffing in here, so I mean, there may be some, but it's just not obvious enough to me. And if I open up a normal pork pie, it's, again, I'm trying to see what the difference is between a normal pork pie. And I mean, there may be a slight difference if you look really, really, really hard. But you have to look really hard to tell the difference, truthfully. Um... I'm still simply more of a stuffing taste, I will be fair. There is more of a stuffing taste in there. I don't know why, maybe it's just, no, they did it, but there is more of a stuffing taste. Compared to the normal pork pie, so yes. Uh, just try the, the meat bit alone, just to see. Yes, there is stuffing in there, I will be fair, you're right, so it's just not obvious by looking at it, but it is there, so. I'm done. And the stuffing is probably similar to how you can get these, um. You know, those pork type batches, you know. 
and I've had broken stuffing in the batches sometimes with apple sauce. Okay, and finally, the last one because <coughs> as I said, there's only <coughs> three different types on this, so it's just and this one is the Christmas one. This is the cranberry one. This claims it has um, two pork and cranberry pie, pork pies topped with beetroot red crumb topping, all encased in a rich hot water crust pastry. Okay, so all of them in the hot, hot crust pastry. So now if I break this open, you see the like dots on the top of their beetroot. Apparently, you've got beetroot dots on the top, and now if I, I cut this open, yep, it's very slightly, it's very hard to see. But if you look very carefully, there's a little bit there of this must be a bit of cranberry. It's very difficult to see in here, but it was in there, okay? I think you see little dots of cranberry there, okay? And if I break open further, let me see a few, a few more. I'm just going to eat this because it's annoying. Okay. And you can see a bit of cranberry, okay? The food featuring cranberry is sold traditionally here at Christmas. You can't normally get food with cranberry the rest of the year. You might be able to look at if you look hard enough in the ingredients section, but you will not find ready made food generally having cranberry in it generally. I mean you have to look really hard probably. Apart from at Christmas time. Um at Christmas I do lots of things with cranberry in, okay? What cranberry has to do with Christmas I have absolutely no idea, but there you go. Learn differences can be quite juicy, okay? Now, the stuffing tends to be somewhat sour in taste, okay? And a normal pork pie is also slightly sour, okay? I think, okay? And stuffing makes it a bit still I think slightly that's not probably the best way to describe it that's the easiest way I can explain to people if they haven't tried it okay um, so there you go guys Um, I'm not going to basically show you just the packaging on its own on the back. I did read out what it said, but I'll and I'll do that again. What it says is selection of two cured pork pies, two pork and stuffing pork pies topped with sage and parsley crumb topping and two pork and cranberry pork pies topped with beetroot red crumb topping all, this means all of them, encased in a rich hot water crust pastry. Okay, so thanks for watching guys. Bye!